Well, Singapore is looking at ways to prevent insured citizens from overspending on unnecessary medical treatments. Describing it as a moral hazard, Health Minister Ong Yi Kang says such wastage could push up national health care costs. Mr Ong was speaking at the Singapore Economic Policy Forum. When every insured patient behaves the same way and inflicted by moral hazard, the collective action will push up national health care costs unnecessarily and with a lot of wastage. In this case, it will come back, the wastage will come back to us in terms of higher health care insurance premiums. And if it's a market-based system, those with lower incomes may have to forego their private insurance coverage. Mr Ong adds the health ministry is considering regulatory measures to cut salt consumption and incentivise people to keep fit. To do that, it's looking to introduce differentiated insurance premiums pegged to whether people keep themselves healthy or not. An analyst says differentiated premiums are a good move as they would drive a message of self-responsibility. But she adds it will be difficult to keep track of what makes for a healthy lifestyle. They can measure their physical activity, but how are you going to capture their diet? And diet is actually an equally important risk factor uh, in terms of whether people are going to develop chronic medical conditions or not. So, I but I think that it is not impossible. It is probably a case where they need to be relatively flexible in how they define um, healthy and a, a healthy lifestyle.